move on with you guys, Matt. Okay, so the uh, county supervisors where I live, when they have a, an ordinance uh, up for consideration, there's this thing called a, a board letter that kind of tells you about it. Yep. And there's always been a row on it. At the beginning, there's a section, it's called a uh, business impact statement. And they, they've never been very thoughtful, you know, in their analysis of that. Like when the county passed our eviction ban, the business impact statement was, this ordinance will help tenants and families. And that was the, the that was the business impact statement. It had nothing to do really with business. But they've recently added a new paragraph to every ordinance called the equity impact statement. And these answers are often a paragraph or a page long. And there's someone putting a lot of effort uh, into when they write this. And my local newspaper, there's every page has an article that works equity in somehow. Every press release from our politicians is always everything's through the lens of equity and and maybe I'm defining it wrong, but it's close to best definition I can say when I hear equity that means bringing equal outcomes. We're saying it's not equal opportunity; it's equal. We're pushing for equal outcomes and equal outcomes. People having you know the same amount of stuff. That's pretty much the point of communism. The main feature of communism is everyone has the same amount of stuff. So. Everyone is openly advocating for equity, but none of these people would say self-identify as a communist. But I feel like they're pushing for the same thing. What am I missing here? Well, what you're missing is that they don't take the concept seriously, right? People are saying equity, they don't know what it means. They have no clue what it means. They have a vague notion that equity is the word they're supposed to say right now if they believe in fairness, if they believe in justice. Uh, ask them what fairness and justice means. They don't really know. They certainly don't think it means communism. Um, they certainly don't think it means equality of outcome. If they did, they would reject it if it was put in stark terms. Um, so there are, uh, there are people out there who are clearly communists, or I don't know communists, but they're egalitarianism. They're, 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 they're worse than communists, in my view. The egalitarians, they're, they're really, really bad guys who want equality of outcome. The people out there, usually intellectuals, usually on the left, usually at universities, they don't actually work for a living. They don't actually participate in life. They're, 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 they're somewhere in the intellectual stratospheres. Um, but they set the terms of debate. So they make, they know what equity means, but they'll never admit it. But they make it so that equity is the word you have to say if you're going to be cool, if you're going to be good, if you're going to be just, if you're going to be acceptable to in society, right? Whatever that means. And uh, so everybody else starts using equity. I don't know what it means. It's just the right thing to say. And it kind of vaguely means fairness and it kind of vaguely means not making a lot of money. But of course, I am going to make a lot of money. I don't care. I'm just going to put this in a statement. You know, nobody cares. And, it, you know, and it, that's how it spreads to society, it becomes just a term that everybody uses. But of course, it has a meaning that the intellectuals give it. And they're going to use it against you over and over again when they raise your taxes. It's just getting in the name of equity. And you agreed that equity was a good thing, you used it in your own thing. And that's how they slowly erode your freedoms and erode your, um, you know, your confidence in what you're doing. Um, just looking for a, uh, let me just, uh, one second. You know, here is a, a this is just a website it says equality means each individual or group of people is given the same resources opportunities. All right, what does that even mean? Who given by whom? Resources, you're given resources. Who gives you those resources? It's a BS definition. But anyway, equity recognizes that each person has different circumstances that and allocates the exact resources and opportunities needed to reach an equal outcome. Yeah. Um, so there it says equal outcome, right? Yeah. 
Yeah. But nobody actually holds that in terms of what that means, other than, yeah. I guess, the person who wrote this article. Right? So yes. if you've got a lot, you get a little, your opportunity set is reduced. If you have a little, you get a lot. Your opportunity set is increased um, in order to achieve equality of outcome. Very but, uh, What's that? It just makes me cringe and, and it's, it's everywhere, uh, you know, in these all the local publications and it's just like it's just presented as a no-brainer that if you don't support equity you're just a horrible person and you know and that's like not contested and, and, at all and it's not what equity actually means equity means fairness which means the exact opposite of that i mean i, I like the word equity i own equity in stocks it means you know it means it, it doesn't mean what they've made it into meaning Mm -hmm. they, they lost on equality. They lost on fairness. So now they're trying with the equity. Here's a quote from Paula Dressel from the, and you can't believe, you know, the names of these institutes just are unbelievable. She works for the Race Matters Institute, which three years ago, I would have assumed was a white supremacist organization. And now I know as to be an anti-racist organization. Race Matters Institute. And this yes. is the goal. The route to achieving equity will not be accomplished through treating everybody equally. It will be achieved by treating everyone justly according to their circumstances. Now, there's a sense in which I, understand, I, I, I agree, but I have a sense that we completely disagree on what justly means. And that's the point. Equity just means treating people justly. Sounds good. Count me in. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's what you mean. But that's reliance on how do we, us having a common definition of what justice is. And then yep. there, there's not, you know, uh, agreement on that. Yeah. And this is, this is from a website on public health from George Washington University. All right, I just saved the article. I'll do a show on that. I'll do a show on equity versus equality. All right, that'll be fun. Oh. Um, right, <laughs> thanks, man. Right. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think, meaning any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence, and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brutes. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes that should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see I want to see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see your actual views being reflected in the likes. But uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share and uh, you can support the show at youronbookshow.com slash support or on Patreon or Subscribestar or Locals. Uh, and uh, and show your support for all for, for for the work for the value hopefully you're receiving from this, and uh, and of course don't forget if you're not a subscriber even if you even if you just come here to troll or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe because that way you'll know when to show up you'll know what shows are on when they're on you'll get notified right so um, yes like. 
share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please.